OSMRE animated logo followed by photos of the unreclaimed Kuiper AML site in Marion County, Iowa, May 2023. Mines and Minerals Bureau Chief Vince Sitzman. Our department recently received a huge influx of funds um, through the infrastructure funding bill. So t historically, we've been about a $3 million program and we've been that way for quite a while. So this site here would be more than one year's worth of budget at the $2.8 million amount, which is why the new bill funding is so huge and so important to our program. Uh, we're gonna be tripling our budget. So we're gonna be close to a $9 million program. And we feel like we will have a good opportunity to knock out most of those 180 sites over the next 15 years. And that's how long we'll get this increased funding. Video of unreclaimed land features followed by Soil Conservation and Water Quality Division Director Susan Kozak. Probably 15 years ago or more, I went out to do the inventory at the site and we were very excited that it was a great project to do, it really needs the reclamation, but it was too big at that time for our current budget. So the bill funding is very valuable to our program to be able to tackle some of these larger sites that normally we would not be able to afford to reclaim. So this one's been sitting there just waiting for the money. Thanks to available funding, Iowa is taking on its very first Infrastructure and Investment Act funded project, also known as the Bipartisan Infrastructure Law. The Kuiper AML site, located in Marion County, Iowa, will soon move from the conceptual design phase to the preliminary phase to reclaim the 84-acre site. Initially mined nearly 100 years ago and abandoned for over 60, it's been troubled by priority features such as hazardous water bodies, dangerous piles, embankments, pits, soil areas, and dangerous high walls. Environmental Engineer Wally Greenlease. My favorite part is seeing the change from what we see at a bare unreclaimed site to a, a concept, an idea on paper, to the real thing being made. That transformation is fabulous. I love it. And that is the best thing I enjoy about this kind of work. Photos of local community members learning about the project, followed by Susan Kozak. When we're done, we hope that nobody knows that it was a former coal mine and really it, it transforms into the landscape and just blends into the rolling hills of southern Iowa, the grassy areas. Um, it, it truly is an environmental benefit. AML and Regulatory Specialist Tiff Hilton. You know, the more we can make them aware and we can have more engagement from the community is the more we can find these places where we can, you know, change the ecology back to you know, what it was or make it even better than what it, what it is currently. Senior Environmental Specialist, Ryan Starkey. As far as community members, you're just looking at better water quality downstream, eventually flowing into the Des Moines River. So it's hard to say how many people that actually impacts with how many people are getting their water source off the Des Moines River. Learn more at www.osmarie.gov forward slash BIL.